Sydney. Over eight years ago, when I finally worked up the courage to ask you out, and you kindly said no, <laughs> something about you kept drawing me back. I had no idea what it was at the time, but I knew deep down that our story was not supposed to be over before it started. When we first started dating, my mom told me, love is friendship caught fire. I think about this all the time, because at the center of everything, you're my best friend in the entire world. When we started dating, I'm not sure if either of us realized what we were getting ourselves into. Over four years of long distance, and sometimes going months without seeing one another. We beat the odds, and I would do it all over again. Good evening. My name is Joel. I also have the distinct honor of being known as Sydney's dad and the father of the bride. Despite having 25 years to prepare for my father of the bride speech, I am standing here today speechless at how beautiful she looks. So cute. Oh, so look at my baby. As I reflect on our relationship with Sydney, it seems that her terrible twos lasted until she was around 12. But then magically, our little girl began to grow up into one of the most sensitive, caring, and loving people who I've ever met. We're here today to celebrate someone I've known for a long time, someone I'm closer to than almost anyone. And sitting right next to her is my brother, Zach. I know everyone says this about their big brother, but mine really is the best. Zach has always been my role model. He is the most caring and selfless person I know. Said, you have brought so much joy into Zach's life in a way I've never seen before. And of course, you look absolutely beautiful tonight. Am I right, everyone? May the source and power of the universe bless these loving companions, Zachary and Sydney as they celebrate their wedding together today. You know each other so well. You've known each other since you were kids. And now you know each other as you grow into adults and lives together. And you have a whole lifetime together to continue to share. Let there be so much more you still haven't found out about your partner and the blessings and wonder they can bring to your life and to the world. Zach. I stand here today truly feeling like the most special and luckiest girl in the world because I get to stand here with you. You're the kindest, most caring, handsome, passionate man that always pushes me to be the best version of myself. You're the person that I want to share everything with. You're the one that helps calm me down, relax me when I'm anxious, and you're the one that makes me laugh until my stomach hurts. When I look into your eyes, I know I found my home with you. Beautiful. Along this journey, something amazing happened. Zachary found someone, a partner, that makes you, Zach, a better you. Sydney, you're an incredible person. And although it only became official today, Stacy and I feel like you've been our daughter and part of the Fight family for a long time. I'm Yilo D. The Dodi Lee. I am my beloved. And my beloved is mine. You've spoken the words, performed the rites that unite your lives. Zachary and Sydney, you are now husband and wife. In the sight of God, the Jewish community, the laws of this state, and all people. Mazel tov! Sydney, Zach, I wish you a lifetime of love and happiness. I can't wait to see what the future holds for you two. I love you. Mazel tov to Mr. and Mrs. Fight.